Hey guys, welcome to another video. This is a comment I received on my website a couple days ago. And it's the mortgage company admits that it wrongfully reported my spouse in bankruptcy. And it says they'll have it fixed in six weeks. Do we have any recourse? Well, one option would be you could just wait and see if they fix it. Now that, to me personally, is not very satisfying because if they messed it up in the first place, why would I assume that they will actually fix it in six weeks? I may get to the end of six weeks and they go, oh, four more weeks, another six weeks, and I'm having to deal with this error. So what I would do is first figure out, is your mortgage company considered a debt collector? In other words, do they meet the definition of a debt collector under the FDCPA, the Fair Debt Collection Practices Act? And we have a whole series of videos on the FDCPA. But basically, when your mortgage company got the loan, was it in default or was it current? If it was current, then your mortgage company is not going to be a debt collector. If it was in default, they probably are a debt collector. And so that's one thing to figure out is, is your mortgage company considered a debt collector? And if they are, then the FDCPA, Fair Debt Collection Practices Act, Section 1692E8, tells us that if they either knowingly do false credit reporting or they should know that their credit reporting is false, then you can sue them because they're violating the law. Now, what if they're not a debt collector? Or what if you just want to make sure you want to give them a chance before you sue them? We'll send a letter to the credit bureaus. So that's Equifax, Experian, TransUnion, SageStream, Enovis, those types of guys. And say, look, mortgage company is reporting me as in bankruptcy. I'm not in bankruptcy. Here's the letter from the mortgage company, or here's the email, or whatever it is, showing that you're not in bankruptcy. And if they fix it, great. If they don't fix it, then they've got really big problems. Because first of all, they admitted that they were doing it wrong. And then you disputed it, and they didn't fix it. So that would be a pretty good lawsuit to bring against them. And we've had cases like this involving mortgage companies. So I hope that this is helpful to you. If you have any questions or comments, just feel free to put those below. My contact information is on uh, the screen if you're in Alabama, 205-879-2447 or alabamaconsumer.com. And if you like this video, feel free to subscribe and then you'll get more of these. And I appreciate you watching this. Okay, see you in the next one. Bye-bye.